Hello everyone. We are discussing chapter number four, that is simple equation of class seven. And in this video, we will talk about some application questions of simple equation. So here we have some questions, and that we need to solve. Or the how we will see how we solve and how we set up the equation. After that, how to find the uh, answer for that variable or value of variable. We will see this in this video. So let's solve the first question we have. Una subtract ties the number of notebook he has from 50 and he find the result to be 8. Okay, see here this term is called ties that means 3 times and the number of book notebook he has. Right? So we don't know the number of notebook he has. So let's take Munna has Munna has X number of notebook. We are taking X number of notebook. Right? So Munna has X number of notebook. Now he subtract size of the number of notebook he has from 50. From 50 he will subtract and he find the result to be 8. And he find the result to be 8. After subtracting he get result and that is what 8. Means the Munna will be 3 times subtract here. Uske pa jitne bhi notebook hai. Uske 3 times subtract here. This is 50 se. And if to uske bhi hai. Usko mila ki. Uske pa skitne hai. 8 hai. Answer uska kya hai. 8. So according to question. What we can form. Right here subtract. He is subtracting from 50. Minus 3 times the x. 3 times the x. And the result is 8. Then the result is 8. Okay, now we we'll solve this question. How we can solve this question? 50 minus 3x is equal to 8. Then we we'll transfer this from 50 to that side. We we'll get minus 3x is equal to 8. It would be minus 50 because it is, this one is the positive. So on the other side it would be negative. Then it would be minus 3x is equal to this would be 8 minus 50. That would be minus 42. Then x now we transfer this minus 3 to right hand side. Minus 3 to right hand side. What will be? Minus 42. And here minus 3 is multiplied with x. So on another side it will be divide. So x is going to be negative and negative will cancel up. And this will be 14. So he has how many numbers of book? He has 14 numbers of book. He has 14 notebooks. And that is the answer for this. Are you clear? Let's see the another question we have. That is what Anwar sings a number and he takes away 7 from the 5 by 2 of a number. So 5 by, 5 by 2 of a number and the result is 23. Result is 23. So what is the basic funda? The number or which is the unknown value that we take as a variable. Then we will solve or we will set up the equation according to the question. Now we will see Anwar takes a number and he takes away 7 from 5 by 2 of number. So then that number that number is x. We don't know the number, so we are taking that as variable and that is x. Then 5 by 2 one number and he takes away 7. Takes away that means subtraction. X away means subtraction. So that is 5 by 2 of a number according to question. What will this? 5 by 2 of a number. So 5 by 2 x minus 7 and this is equal to 20. This is equal to 23. Then we will transfer, we will solve this by the transposing method. We can solve this 5 by 2 x is equal to this 7. On that side it will be what? 23 plus 7. And then 5 by 2 x is equal to this will be 23 plus 7 will be 30. Then we will transfer this 5 by 2. 5 by 2 is multiplied with that. So on one other side it will be x is equal to 30. And then multiply 2 by 5 plus opposite to it 2 in denominator and 5 into denominator 2 is in, here 2 is in denominator so on another side it will be in, in numerator here 2 in denominator so the other side it will be in numerator and we can it is in numerator so on another side it will be in denominator so this x will be you can simplify this 5 from the 5 6 and 6 to the 12 so x that number is 12 that number is 12. I hope it is clear. Let's solve the next question on you. The question is in an isosceles triangle, the base angles are equal. Isosceles triangle means a triangle which two sides are equal. Then the vertex angle is 40 degree. What are the base angles of a triangle? So let's draw angle and draw drawing a isosceles triangle. Let's suppose these two sides are 
equal. Two sides are equal. This angle, these two are the base angle, and this one is the vertex angle. So here vertex angle is given what 40 degree and these two angles are equal. These two angles are equal, that means when I am taking this as x. I am taking this as x. Now this is triangle. Now what are the base angles of this triangle? We need to find the base angle. What are the base angles? So here we know the sum of all angles of a triangle is 180 degree. This we have studied so far. What the sum of all angles of a triangle is 180 degree. That means according to the question, what we write that here we write x degree plus x degree plus 40 degree and this will be what? This will be equal to 180 degree. This will be equal to 180 degree. Now we will see x and x so that become 2x plus 40 and this is equal to 180 degree. Now we will solve this by separable of variable method we can solve. So how we can do that? First here it is 40 degree add in 40 so we will subtract 40 and we will subtract 40 on both sides of the equation so that will be as what 2x plus 40 and then minus 40 is equal to 180 minus 40 so this will be 40 and 40 so 2x is equal to this will be 140 now we cancel out this step 2 and that will what divide 2 on both sides so we will do 2x divided by 2 is equal to 140 divided by 2 and this will get as x is equal to 2 1 the x to 7 the 0 the so x is equal to 70 degree we will get x is equal to 70 degree we will get x on the zero of these base angles are 70 degree and this one is also 70 degree i hope it is clear the base angles are 70 degrees so 70 and 70 140 140 and 40 that is equal to 180 so this is how you solve this question okay we'll see the next question of it the question is to know but there is nothing about it don't be scared right so we'll understand what the question is people of sundarga planted trees in a village garden right so, so they planted planted trees in a village garden some of the trees were fruit trees some of them some of them were fruit trees and some of them were non fruit trees so the number of non fruit trees were two more than three times what is that two more than three times this one is what the number of non fruit trees right two more than three times the number of fruit trees jitne jitne number of fruit trees hain usse two more as three times two more and three times there are the non fruit trees so what was the number of fruit trees planted if the number of non fruit trees were 77 what is the number of non fruit trees so that is what 77 so what is unknown value we don't know the value of fruit trees so let's take take let's take the number of fruit trees Fruit trees are is equal to x, right? Now the non non fruit trees were non fruit trees were is equal to what? That is what two more than and three times. Two more than three times. That means what? Three times x plus two, and this is equal to what? Seventy seven, and this is equal to what? 77. So according to question, the gate word that will get as 3x plus 2 and this is equal to 77. 3x plus 2 is equal to 77. So this is how we get the equation of it. So don't be scared that so long person it is just try to understand what is given, right? And set up an equation according to the question. Now we will solve this question. So what we get is just transfer this plus 2 to the right hand side. What we get is on transposing transposing 2 to R X S we get what 3x is equal to 77 minus 2 because here it is added to so on another side it will be minus 2. Then you will see this 3x is equal to 77 minus 2 so that becomes 75. Now we will subtract or transfer this 3 to the RHS. What we get is x is equal to 75 by 
3 because here 3 is multiplication so on another side it will be division so x is equal to 25 so the number of fruit trees were 25 right so number of fruit trees are 25 in that village garden of Sundarga I hope this question is clear so fruit trees were 25